AKA Architect and AKA Swifty Spider, depending on where you find me. Today I am definitely Swifty Spider, and I am playing on a recording it now. I've actually already played my turn, more or less, and the reason I didn't record all that is, well, I actually did, and uh, my disk space ran out. So I kind of got uh, screwed there. Uh, oh well, so we got this. Um, now, uh, for you guys that are in Accordia, Mitt Romney, especially um, Custache there, and uh, Cesardis, uh, as well as everybody else, um, I wanted to talk to you guys because um, uh, I, I think I kind of did a thing that, um, or a couple things here that may or not may not be exactly to the rules. Uh, certainly, I was trying to follow the rules uh, in spirit, if nothing else. And um, just sort of to go over those with y'all real quick. So I have this rail system going through my district, and the assumption that I had made, or not the assumption, but the the hope that I had made, the the proposal that I make, is that we have this rail right here. That we bring this rail, and if Costash is uh, okay with it, we bring it through his um, district here and connect it up. Uh, alternatively, we could maybe bring it down along or on either side of this and, and connect it over the freeway or something like that. I don't like that as much because we already have so much going on there, but it's it's something that is certainly a possibility. Um, Mitt Romney, uh, if you don't like it going through your... Uh, so we have this area here, so I was thinking we could bring um, the rail from here um, around uh, on either side of this uh, across and into Mitt Romney's uh, district, and then he could do what he wishes with it and it connect up to here. Um, if Mitt Romney doesn't want to do anything with this rail, he's like, yeah, I don't want this rail in my district, uh, we could possibly skirt it up along here and bring it over around uh, Mitt Romney's district or something like that. Um, that's not nearly as clean, and I, I don't like that as much, but uh, that's just a... Again, a proposal that I'm making here and here, those are easily enough deleted. Uh, I figured that I'd go ahead and do it, and then if we just don't like them, uh, or if we need to vote on them and it gets voted down, or uh, however that needs to go, um, that's fine. Now, kind of did an other thing here. Um, so I, I kind of asked, and um, I didn't wait for Cesardis, and uh, I did see your post. Uh, much, much later. Uh, it's about 2.30 in the morning. I've just now seen your post, uh, Central Time. And um, I kind of did go ahead and utilize the area between my district and the river here. Um, and really all I did is I, I, I added in a canal here for my district, and then I put a bunch of water pumps on it. So I didn't really do anything to it besides that, but that is not uh, necessarily insignificant and I also obviously um, deleted and rebuilt this road here and just slightly changed the elevation of these two intersections to make this uh, bridge over my canal work properly. Obviously I also added in these power lines here so if um, this is going to be a major problem obviously I kind of built my my district around the idea of the canal once uh, I, I had put that in. Um, uh, I if, if I need to take it back out, I, I will figure something out. No worries. Um, kind of uh, kind of hoping we keep that in there at least. Um, I, I think that uh, it really does add something to the district and the city as a whole. Because um, I try to not just simply put in a, a canal system for my own thing, but I try to continue what uh, we had here from... Uh, carbon inspector um, as far as having keeping this axial uh, visual uh, axis here and trying to, to, to make something of that um, without necessarily bringing a road in because bringing a road into this area here or curving it off I, I didn't like that as much and so that was kind of the whole idea behind this that, that spurred that on is trying to have a nice good axis 
to uh, a viewing access that is not necessarily uh, just pure road. Um, so what I did here is I, I mostly have offices here and along the edge here. I have some commercial down here and then all the rest of this is residential. And I really, um, I tried to, even though this is part of my district and I did this, kind of made it, uh, at least in uh, feeling, be a little bit more like carbons here. Um, I tried to continue this road in vain and, and, and have these kind of go up the, the hill here in a, in a way that was reminiscent of what's going on across the avenue here. Um, this area here is also part of my district and I more or less left alone. I did put in some trash collection and obviously I have a train station here that um, assuming uh, things go uh, as proposed uh, both here and here or or even if uh, a variant of what I propose goes on, um, this train station can serve not only my district, but also the other three uh, neighboring districts, carbon inspectors, uh, Tim Riley's, and uh, what is that? Uh, can't read that. Mukita? Yeah, Mukitas. So um, that's what I got going, guys. Uh, I hope you all like it. Um, you know, as far as the stats on the city at this point, uh, we got uh, 46,272 population. Uh, we are actually uh, at $6,000 in the surplus. Um, I did also have one bus route uh, added on added within my city or my, my district, I should say. Um, I did add one high school, one elementary school and one university in my district. We have one police headquarters, we have one fire headquarters, and we have both a cemetery and two crematoriums. I didn't do any health care because uh, honestly I just it was unnecessary. We have uh, one garbage and two incineration plants or, or one landfill I should say. Um, we have four water pumps here. And then last but not least, uh, I just I just connected to the power grid because uh, somebody, I'm not going to name names, but um, it was like somebody kind of went a little power happy here. So I said, you know what, I, I think it's covered. I, I think it's covered. I don't know. Uh, we might need to add some more power because uh, I'm not sure that it's covered, but I think, I, I think it's covered. So, yeah. Um... I didn't add any power there. Uh, I do have some room for expansion along the edges of my um, district here. Um, I, I purposely didn't do too much here because A, um, I also I, I am rem, uh, cognizant of the fact that we may uh, want to change how certain things are done with this rail here. Um, and B, I wanted to give myself something to do on the next round. Um, to try and figure some of this stuff out. So, I hope you like it, guys. Uh, I actually, I really love the look of it, uh, not only individually uh, as a district, but I like how it uh, is connecting to the city here, uh, the context of the city, uh, both uh, Nikita's here. I didn't really, like, literally connect, because Nikita was connecting on the margins here, and I. but what I did do is I made sure that this right here, uh, if you just, continue Max Jackson Street straight to that intersection that is a perpendicular straight shot and so that that should not be hard uh, should that choice be made um, uh, I tried to continue this pedestrian pathway here um, and, and connect it directly to the um, train station although you do have to watch a walk by a garbage uh, dump in order to get there. <laughs> um, and then obviously we have, uh, I think the most direct and obvious uh, connection to the existing context is this uh, continuation of the axis uh, that Carbon Spectre introduced um, all the way th down through the district and into the river here. Um, that's all I got to say guys. Um, thanks so much for letting me be a part of this. Hopefully uh, nobody hates me too bad for these three little uh, additional interventions. 
Um, certainly was not intended to be something to offend or to thumb my nose at or anything like that. Uh, I was honestly and earnestly hoping that uh, it would make the city better and uh, also encourage some, uh, oh, what's the word, uh, some team, not team building, but uh, encourage teamwork for it with us to, to make these rails, this rail happen, kind of connect the city. I mean, uh, should this happen, um, I, could, I could easily see a rail station going here, um, maybe a, perhaps cargo rather than a uh, passenger station. And having this rail connect up to that, uh, you got that train station there, and uh, that I think could make a really big difference. Um, and then uh, even if Mitt Romney, if all he did was do a loop and, and bring it back, uh, do a loop, uh, put a train station here and bring it back, I think that would be a really big deal for connecting uh, the city from here to my district over uh, to... Uh, is it Tsunami's district that has the train station, I believe? Where, where'd it go? I lost track. I totally... Oh, no, no, it's over here. Um, it's over here, Nuki Dukes. Sorry. Um, so if Nuki Dukes... Uh, Nuki Duke, mine, and Rick Romney's gets connected. Um, and, and mine, by the way, I, I really consider it connecting this whole uh, four set of, of districts, not simply my own. Um, and Mitt Romney has a, a really nice big plot here that, um, if, especially if he stuck it over here, uh, and it, I don't know if we're going to be able to continue out past this, but um, it, it can really add to the um, connectivity of the city, especially as it goes uh, on out over here if we do connect, make that connection there. Okay, uh, I think I've hammered that home enough. I'll let you guys go. You can tell I'm tired, <laughs> but I had so much fun. I really uh, appreciate it, guys. Talk to you later.